guys and welcome back to a brand new video and it is a friday morning today and it's about a week away before the christmas market opens up here in blackpool so i thought this morning have a little wonder see what's happening what can we expect for the upcoming weeks and just see can we get like a bit of a sneak peek what's going to be there and just stuff like that really look like it don't rain today here in blackpool but hopefully not so let's just get on with the video so i just seen the sign and it don't be remembrance um parade on sunday the 10th just remembering all the people who lost their lives But so far, it's looking quite quiet. You've got a couple of cars um, around, probably people making their way to work. Look like the arcade is getting ready to open. But it, it is sadly coming out of season now. But one good thing about Blackpool, they always know how to draw people back into the town, even when we're not in season. Uh, we've always got something happening all year round really haven't we in Blackpool so we're just quite lucky to have that it looked like the sea is out but I'll show you that in a second and it looked like they're doing something on the tram lines so I don't know what's happening here maybe they're repairing a tram track maybe Oh no, I look like they're going underground. And it looked like they're still doing work at the side slash under North Pier. They've been doing that for quite some time now. But yeah, the sea is out, so it is perfect to walk your dogs down on the beach today. As you can tell, you can see like the lorries and like fur rides have already been put in place. And I could be wrong, but it looked like they came a bit more further up next to the North Pier this year. Or less than added some more stuff. But it is quite popular. And there are always different things to do. You got a sweet tooth, then got your sweet um, selections there feeling a bit peckish or something not always got the food stands there or oh, you want the thrill and going on some rides then they got some swings what go up and you go around and around and around personally that one ain't for me but i know there'll be a lot of thrill seekers out there who would love it So here we got some icebreaker. We even got some waltzes this year. Oh, I do like the waltzes to be fair. It is all blocked up so you can't get too close just as yet. And right here, that probably were the ice skating ring will go again. But yeah, it looked like we got a couple of bits of different type of rides, a lot more bigger rides. We got the Super Bob. I don't know what that ride would be all about. It looked like we got like a um, little ghetto with Santa and the reindeers on top. So I wonder would that be like a meet and greet so you can go see Santa. Looked like they got a couple of... Um, polar bear snowman's outside of there so that might be a grotto or it might be the outside bar again that one they did last year but yeah it looked like we got the little hutches back what sell your food and drinks we even got a slide a bit of a weird one the slide but it's a normal pier having a slide on there but with the bad storms we have it it seemed to went overboard so let's hope that one is a lot more fastening down and the winds keep away 
Yeah, yeah so we're just on like the tourist hotspot now, the AKA Comrie Carpet. And every Friday, this is where they do like a radio. So all this will be full, people be singing, dancing away, while I'm watching the tower. But yeah, a bit of a close up on the slide, what seemed to be happening. Loaded fries right there. So one of them you'll be able to get some loaded fries. Of course, we've got like hutches on both sides. We, I can see like a donut one right there. I do like a homemade donut, like a freshly hot donut from Blackpool Seafront. So I got to admit, we got the slide back there where you sit on the rug and you go sliding down, of course. I suppose it is in the name, ain't it? Slide. Oh, the snow slide it cold. Of course, we got the Blackpool Council fan there, probably having having a check, seeing everything all running on time. And of course, we got the German sausage windmill right over there. The only thing what they might need to do now is get a couple of more bins out close by. Then the rubbish won't end up on the floor. Sweet and fudge. Oh, I think I might have a little look in there when it opened. And the, school, the swings, what I was mentioning about, the sky dance. Then all back and up. You seem to never end in this height, look at that. But you bet you're not actually that high. It'd be like mind over matter. But yeah, I do like my feet just touching the ground. And definitely when you only just look at them, they just look like thin pieces of rope. Even so, it'd be like metal that seems to be holding it. Like, what do you do? One of them come off or something? Yeah. I always think about the worst. <laughs> this is the other quite popular one, definitely at night. It's the lights. You walk through there, normally you got a man with a bucket. You put your donations in, I think, or I don't know if you need to pay. Uh, I ain't 100% sure so which one it is, but I know it's one or the other. But not long ago, we thought these were broken. Someone going around saying they were broken, but I've seen them the other night and they never looked broken to me. So that always nice to see. I wonder would they be keeping here until Christmas time now. Would they do rent them out and do it end up all over the UK I believe so. This is the other one that's where people stand underneath here, get the pictures. Oh, tuck and stuff. They do look nice when it's all dark and the and the lights is turned on. Boy, look like we got a couple of lights turned on here. So someone forgot to turn them off. And it looked like the showers have been turned up by the water mains now. I think in the past of my couple of videos, I have mentioned about the shower to keep raining. Right then guys, that's done by the end of this video. If you enjoyed that little sneak peek like what is going to be happening and what's going to be taking its place down on the Christmas market, then please give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to see any more videos of Blackpool and the surrounding areas, then please hit the subscribe button. If you don't want to miss any upcoming videos, turn on the notification bell. 
and i'll see you on the next one